just wiping off the lens. I am all fresh faced. I'm actually literally still in kind of my pajamas. <laughs> Hi, I'm Jackie. I'm your healthy witness. I want to thank you for being here with me. Today is day two of only three of my three-day refresh. It's not just three days. It's the three longest days ever. I love food. I love to eat. This has been my weakness. For spring break, I don't know what you do for spring break, but, you know, we want to relax. We want to check out. We want to do something different. It is our time, spring break. It's exactly what it's for. It's springtime and you need a break. Well, this year during spring break, oops, excuse me, battery's about to die. I had my anniversary, 17 happy, happy years. I love my husband. He supports me. Bless his heart for being married to me. <laughs> so I splurged a little bit. I had some things I hadn't had in a long time and especially had things I know I'm not supposed to have, dairy being one of them. Well, anyway, what you eat today will affect you a week or two weeks later. Some people don't realize that. The people that do realize it are the people who are really in tune with their bodies, like myself. But right now, I'm having a snack I want to show you. It is sliced cucumbers with homemade hummus. My hummus is literally some chickpeas out of a can, rinsed twice, blended in a little tiny food processor with water, olive oil, very olive oil and some lime juice. I am here in Central America and the limes here are really sweet and yummy. It's the kind of limes that people put like in their, I guess it's just a lime. But, um, excuse me, I got itch in my arm. <laughs> All right, so I'm here to share with you that I'm doing very well. I am having slight headaches a little bit. I think that's due to maybe caffeine withdrawal. I do have chocolate every day, except during this three-day refresh. I stick to the book books over there but I stick to it and I and chocolate's not on there it's not any of the options I've looked a lot of us try to say chocolate's a veg, vegetable because it comes from a bean but anyway so maybe that's the withdrawal I'm getting a little headaches I'm getting I've chosen not to cut these three days as well because I think um it would even be harder <laughs> I'm already you know struggling I catch myself when I lick the spoon. I made the kids a snack, and I wanted to, like, lick the spoon, or I wanted to take a nibble here and there. And during these three days, I am quickly being trained, don't take a bite. Don't lick the spoon. Don't nibble. Because that's what gets me wrong. That's what gets me, sets me back, okay? I have not backslid. I chose to eat bad for a week, and now I'm back on track. You know, that's all choices. Backsliding is Ooh, I'm off the wagon, fell off, not getting back on. I've gained all my weight back or half of it back and things like that. That's what I would call a backslide. This is, again, choices. So I hope to encourage you and motivate you and show you that you, too, can mess up or choose to make an intentional choice and then get back on track. The best thing is, is to get back on your wagon as soon as you can. Get back on the horse. Get, get whatever. Get up. Get going. It is important. You're important. So I want you to do this. I want you to think about what you eat every day. Look at what you're nibbling and what your spoons you're licking or what extra. Because I catch myself even last night after dinner. Excuse me. I started having a, a nighttime snack. My husband does it because he eats this like, you know, six meal thing. I can't do that personally because, again, of my former PCOS uh, tendencies. So he does that. So after dinner, he grabs like a handful of mixed nuts and... Um, you know, we watch videos and he does that. And I was going to do that too. And I caught myself. I was like, that's not part of my three day plan. I can't go grab those nuts. So I realized these three days, how much extra I'm eating, how much little here and there I'm doing. So again, being mindful and be, uh, portions of food, food quality, quantity, and frequency. If you haven't heard me before, those are the three things that you should write down and memorize your food quality. What do you eat? Fast food, clean food, your food quantity, you have a portion, a big portion or a small portion. And your frequency, are you eating breakfast, lunch, and dinner, or breakfast, snack, lunch, snack, dinner, snack, midnight snack, more snack, you know, nibble here and there. So those three things are key. But most of all, during this three-day refresh, again, I am be checked as me, as what's my health, what's my priority, and am I in this for the long haul? And I am. 
you know, if you don't know, I started in 2000, October 2011, changed my eating. About six months later, about the May, April, May, June of 2012, I really catapulted my journey after some research. I started following some people who are in functional medicine or in some serious real nutrition and not the commercial healthy food nutrition that's out there that's myth health foods. You know, this cucumber is a cucumber. Now, it may be part of the dirty dozen. I can't remember right now. But I made sure I cleaned it. I don't know how it was grown. You know, it made, made I don't know. I don't know. But I'll tell you what. This is a cucumber. It's not some processed plant made, plant, you know, manufactured, shipped across country or shipped in country. It's not got a 10-year shelf life. If you haven't heard me say it before or anyone else, the shorter the shelf life, the longer your life. The longer the shelf life, the shorter your life. <laughs> and this hummus, that's chickpeas, some olive oil, and the lime. I mean, that's it. I know the ingredients that are in here. They're real. All right, guys. Well, I appreciate you tuning in to see my progress and my update. I hope you don't mind. No makeup. My hair's not been done or anything. I'm just enjoying my day, relaxing. I have four kids I'm really trying to manage. They're doing better. They have some days. Today's one of their days. Yesterday was one of days. But anyway, we are getting back on track. And Because uh, after spring break, it's really hard to do that, isn't it? We all, even me. All right, guys. Much love to you. Please live your days as healthy as you can. Do some inventory. Check yourself. What are you doing? What are your habits? Are they healthy? If you need adjustment to your habits or need someone just to guide you or just to listen to you, I'm here for you. So right now, if you want, message me right now. Click message and say, hey, like to the video. Let me know. Let me know if you like this video, if you like this information, or say, stop talking. <laughs> I need to know. I need to know. <laughs>